Now, Channel 3 Early Warning Weather with Melissa Cole. Well, def definitely a lot colder out there today compared to yesterday. Yesterday we climbed into the 60s, today only into the 40s for most of us, and we had a lot of cloud cover, so it felt very raw outside. It looked like rain for most of the day today, but it was generally dry. We had a little bit of light shower and even some sleet activity that rolled through parts of north and northwest Connecticut earlier on today, but that is gone, and we are still tracking clear right now, but that is going to be changing as we go on through the later evening hours tonight, and some rain will be coming on down, especially after midnight into early tomorrow morning. Here's a little time lapse video from downtown Hartford. You can see that blanket of gray all across the area and temperatures are generally in the 40s right now. 47 in Berlin, Hartford 46, Willimantic 45, stores 42 and the feels like temperature is a few degrees colder than the actual temperature as there's a bit of a wind out there and that wind will also be increasing overnight tonight too. Here's our ICAM in Waterbury and you can see we have cloudy skies overhead. It's 43 degrees there. East North Easterly winds coming in right now at seven miles an hour. Now here's our satellite and radar picture. Again, not much happening in our local area right now. We have some snow off to our north, and this is a pretty expansive storm system. We've got a cold front and an area of low pressure. The area of low pressure will generally pass to our north, but this cold front's going to be approaching and uh, swinging on through. And ahead of it, we're going to see the showers increase later this evening and overnight. And again, especially by tomorrow morning, some of this heavier rain will be moving on in. So let's check out Futurecast. We'll start at 11 o'clock tonight and go through tomorrow morning and you can see that the showers will pick up in intensity during the overnight hours and especially early tomorrow morning in parts of central and eastern Connecticut. So heading back to work, back to school tomorrow morning around 7, 8 a.m. Be prepared for some heavier amounts of rainfall. You may want to budget in a little extra time. But as we go through the mid morning and midday hours, the heaviest rain pushes off to the east of us into Rhode Island, eastern Massachusetts. And notice the clearing line that's going to be moving on in. So we will expect to see some sunshine for the second half of tomorrow and then falling temperatures we will actually start out the day in the 50s, maybe even near 60 degrees. But by day's end, we're going to be talking about temperatures quickly dropping into the 40s, 30s and then even into the upper 20s, low 30s by the time you wake up on Tuesday morning. So you can see here Tuesday will start out with a good deal of sunshine and throughout the day on Tuesday it will be breezy and cool with temperatures staying in the 40s for daytime highs. Now in terms of how much rainfall we'll likely see out of this system moving on into tonight into early tomorrow morning, generally about an inch, maybe a little bit less, maybe a little bit more it really depends on where some of those pockets of heavier rain set on up. Now our next storm system will arrive on Thursday. So we're dry Tuesday, we're dry Wednesday, although Wednesday the clouds will increase and then on Thursday it looks like our next chance for rain especially in the morning hours with temperatures in the 40s but by the afternoon time we're going to be a little optimistic and hope that some of the rain clears on out and we'll see some breaks with sunshine uh, it is going to be a mild Thanksgiving though it looks like temperatures will top out in the mid maybe even upper 50s so lows for tonight in the 40s but really temperatures are going to be rising all night long again the rain picks up so does the wind highs for tomorrow We'll be in the early part of the day. We'll look for falling temperatures in the afternoon, but a mild start. Uh, sunrise tomorrow is at 651. And here's your early morning forecast for the next few days. And you can see on Tuesday, we're breezy and dry. Wednesday, a high near 50 to 52. That rain moves in for Thanksgiving. But Friday and the first half of the weekend are looking dry and mild. And some showers may arrive again on Sunday.